What's going on, beautiful people of YouTube? This is Rene Bean, and welcome to another episode of eBay slash Macari Game Deals Unboxing. This is that series where I show you all the cool stuff I've gotten through about the past week or so. We open it up, check it out, and what this series is about is to show you that, yes, you can game hunt on these sites. It's not hard at all, and you may find you're getting better deals than you could find out there in the wild. And I know a lot of you guys out there always have trouble finding yard sales and flea markets. This series may be right up your alley. With a little bit of persistence and patience and know-how, you're finding that you're getting some awesome games for your collection at an amazing amazing deal and you may even be making a few bucks on top of that and some free games for your collection. If you've never used Macari, I highly suggest it. It's absolutely amazing. Use my code in the description and you'll get $2 just for signing up and then they'll give you an additional $10. So that's $12 just to sign up. I highly suggest you do it. But guys, I got seven packages here. Sit back and relax. Let's crack into them. Alright guys, so just like always, we're going to go through these packages here. I've written the prices on all the packages with the shipping included, so the price you see is the price that I paid. This one was $44.52. Let's see what we got here. Now, I know what I got, but you don't, and this was an awesome deal right here. I was very, now this was a little bit late to ship, which kind of pissed me off, and that happens sometimes. Sometimes the seller just doesn't want to ship it on time. Um, I'm okay with that because this is an awesome deal right here. And you're going to see why it was one of the biggest packages too. And I kind of wanted to get it out of the way because I knew it was going to be the most awkward. Let's see here. Oh, shit. Now, as I'm opening this, I want y'all to go over there and check out my buddy's YouTube channel. He's, he's a guy I grew up with, man. His name's his name's Deemer. That's what I call him. But his YouTube channel is Woody Pox. He goes by Woody. He's a cool dude. He does a lot of Let's Plays. Check him out. Subscribe to his channel. Hit some likes. I'll leave a link in the description. Tell them Ring Bean sent you. It's Witty Pox. W I T T Y P O X. I'm telling you, you won't regret it. The guy's eye. If you like my humor, you'll like his humor. He's the same way. All right. All right. As you can see, we got an NES here, but for $44, what could it be? Well, we got one NES. And then as you can see, I got three more NESs. So for $44, bucks, 52 cents, I got four NES systems. Now, obviously, they said untested. Uh, don't know if they work. If these things will power on, I can get them. I can get them to work. You know that I refurbish these things, and that basically ten dollars a piece for an NES. That is an amazing deal right there. I will refurb these things, bundle them up because you know I keep everything else on. You know everything else on the side. I got controllers. I got all the power cords. Bundle these systems, and Christmas time is right around the corner. I got I probably got like eight or nine NES consoles on hand right now, and I'm wanting to build them up for when Christmas time comes. Start refurbing the hell out of these things. But let me pull these out. I'm telling you four. NES consoles for 44 bucks. I would put because ten dollars is my limit out in the wild for an NES console. Just the console, that's the most I'm willing to pay. Now this one does not have the lid. Big deal. You can order these, they're not expensive. Uh, let's see. And I highly doubt I got shitted to where none of them power on. And if they don't power on, you can still fix them. It's not as easy. Um, but I'm this was well worth the risk for $44 because if they don't work then I can still flip them as a defective unit. See, that's the thing. I'm not going to be a dick and then resell them as an untested unit. I'm going to say that they'd be defective. Um, but I'm happy about this. $44. Uh, a lot of, I know some of you guys out there uh, aren't scared to buy something and work on it. You know I do it with my game gears, which i I got to get more capacitors. i got some on order, but I, I got a lot of people asking for game gears. I need to order them up. Nothing else in there, but... Uh, just some wrapping. We don't need to worry about that. All right, let's crack into some of these. I'm going to save the last package, which was a guilty pleasure buy for me, but I think it's one that you want to like. All right. We paid five bucks for this one. That's all I paid. This was a Macari deal right here. This was five dollars with free shipping. So, and they paid three dollars and three cents. So they made a dollar ninety-seven on this. Uh, what is it? What could it be? You ask. Well, let's find out. I love Macari. Macari is absolutely awesome. If you've never checked it out, I highly recommend downloading it. You can get some amazing deals, I'm telling you. Use that code I told you about, and you'll get damn $2 to sign up. Uh, you'll get, they'll give you $10 additional. That's 12 bucks right there. But check this out. We got us an any or not, wow. I almost said NES. An SNES controller here. It's, they said it was defective. They said that the start button doesn't work that well. 
Now I'm sure a lot of you already know the fix to that. I'm gonna simply open this up. I got the tools to do it. I'm gonna swipe it with some alcohol. Bam, I got a controller for five bucks. I am, I'm happy to pay that for one of these controllers because they can sell for anywhere from 10 to 15, but I like to keep them on hand to keep bundled. Five dollars was a good deal. All right. This was a quick Macari buy, and I'm finding that's, that's how it happens a lot with Macari. It's, it's real quick buys. You gotta be quick to, to pull that trigger. You can't wait around because there's a thousand other people doing what we're doing. Uh, and this was one that I did not have. Seven bucks was all I paid for this one. This was a good deal. It's nothing crazy, but it's one that I needed for my collection. Double Dragon 3. Now you will notice that it is chipped up right here. That's okay. I'm, I'm okay with that. It, it was a little banged up. I'm still okay with that. It's like a $10, $15 game, but to put that on my shelf and have it done, I'm happy with it. That's all I need to worry about. So seven bucks, Double Dragon 3, a little chipped up. That's it's still fine. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna live, guys. It's not a big deal. I know some of you guys are, are are real anal about you know having a scratch on the label or or you know just any any chips in general. I typically am, but for seven bucks, this is one I wanted. I just I never find it, so I'm happy about that. All right. Let's get into an eBay deal here. This was eleven dollars right here. Now this is when we're gonna start making some free stuff back here, getting some of our money back. All right, for set for eleven dollars, yeah, you can see ten ninety nine right there is what it was. Throw that away. We got a clear Game Boy case, but we got other things. Don't worry, we got actual Game Boy games. And they took the time; they really wrapped these really well. All right, so we got Tetris. Gotta have. I bundle these whenever I refurb a Game Boy, so that's good to have. Super Mario Land. That's another bundler right there. The reason that I bought this lot was for this game right here. I did not have it for the Game Boy. It was Super Street Fighter 2. Very cool to have, so I'm going to keep that. I'm fairly certain I don't have this. Super Breakout and the Battle Zone collaboration. I'm going to put that in the probably going to have to keep pile. Holy shit. Toy Story, which I'm going to have to check. I'm not sure if I have that. And then to get the money back for all this, which was Wario Land, because I already have this. So that and that. I can easily put up there for $11 free ship and that'll go. Uh, but that, that was a good buy right there. That was a quick uh, buy it now, I think is what it was. So 11 bucks, that was good. I'm happy with it. Oh, uh, let's see. So this one right here was $4. And you're gonna ask yourself why, and that's, that's because I had credit. Like I told you, if you sign up with Macari, they give you the credits. They, they always throw out coupons and credits. They're real good for it. This was $4 altogether because I had some leftover credits. Oh my god, this was a good one because I got, I've, I'm able to keep two games and I'm going to make my money back and maybe even make $5, which is good. You know I love my shitty Wii games. I already got that. I'm pretty sure I got that. I don't have Tiger Woods All Play, uh, I'm pretty sure, which I was going to keep. And I don't think I have Pool Party for the Wii. But I also got The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD. Uh, $4? obviously and now this is what it takes this is what I'm talking about with the elbow grease I'm, I'm gonna keep these two games possibly three I'm gonna sell this make my money back and that's usually how it works all right a lot of people just they just don't want to put the time and they don't realize that's how easy it is to grow your collection you just gotta put the little you gotta put, put a little elbow grease back there and you'll, you'll get this stuff done all right do you want to see a really good package this was twenty dollars right here that's all this one was this was an excellent buy it now right here. Now keep in mind, now the one sucky thing about Macari, I'm going to talk about this. And I've had it happen, I'm sure a lot of you have had it happen as well. Leave me a comment below if you did. You buy something only to have it canceled shortly after. It's happened to me a handful of times. I've gotten really good deals only to find it's been canceled. The only thing that I thought it was, was they got, they got wise to what it was. They realized something in their lot was very expensive, which, which could be the case. But I finally found out one thing that it definitely is. Someone is sending them an offer to say, hey, cancel that item. I'll pay you more if you relist it and sell it to me. And I've had that explained to me that that has happened. It almost happened with this one. And I told him, I was like, hey, we purchased this. That's a shitty thing to do. Uh, you know, don't, don't have someone highball my ass. Uh, it's done. Um, but of course, I was nice. I was like, hey, man, I, I was really looking forward to this, which I was. There's one game in here I'm very looking forward to. Um, and I finally got him to resell it to me, you know, because I had to get refunded and then I had to buy it again. 
People can do that. I did not realize that, that people were doing that on my card. It's a very shitty thing to do. If something's sold, don't go over there and message the seller and be like, listen, cancel that transaction with that guy and I'll pay you more. That's a shitty thing to do. The good thing about eBay is they don't pull that shit. There are consequences for, you know, just sellers automatically canceling orders out of nowhere if the buyer is paid. That, that's one thing I like about eBay. But anyways, let's, let's shut up. Let's talk, let's talk about this amazing package right here. I'm very excited about this one. And I think when you see for $20, this was a great deal. So the first game is Sonic the Hedgehog 3. Nothing crazy, but that's a $10 game right there. What else do we got? I'm going to try to pull these out in, in a very inconspicuous manner. We got Mortal Kombat right there. Nothing special. I'll bundle that with the system. All right. And we got, for the money, this will make the money back right here, which is one that I got for Super Nintendo and NES. So I don't need it for Sega, which is Battletoads Double Dragons. Right there for 20 bucks. That would have been a great deal. But what's the fourth game, you might ask? The one that I need for my collection. Turtles in Time, Hyperstone Heist. Or not, wow. Again, I'm fucking up. It's, 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 been, a, it's been a long day. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the Hyperstone Heist. Not Turtles in Time. Wow, I'm a fucking idiot. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Ignore me. My mind's been all over the place today. Hyperstone Heist. I paid $20 for all this right here. I'm going to sell that. Get my money back, make 10 bucks, and look what I'm keeping for free. Hyperstone Heist. Super Nintendo got Turtles in Time. Sega Genesis got Hyperstone Heist. Absolutely excellent right there, guys. Tell me you can't get some good deals on Macari if you know what you're doing. Uh, very happy about that. Now, it is loose, and I am searching for a case, and hopefully I will find one. Because uh, you know I don't like my loose Sega Genesis games. But I had to pick that up. All right. This last package right here. Let's airdrop it down is a guilty pleasure buy but it was still a good deal this was sixty four dollars there may have been some change associated with that hell I don't know but for, and I've been searching for this now in eBay one of the best ways to get something that you're wanting is to save the search results like let's say you were looking for the Legend of Zelda the Wind Waker for the Wii U if you just happen to be looking for that hit newly listed so you can see which one is newly listed make sure you hit your criteria like you're searching literally for the legend of zelda the wind waker wii u hit newly listed and then hit save search with that newly listed save that way each time one pops up you get a notification so you kind of get first dibs as long as you're checking every so often because it's it's really up to you to check it and that's what i do with a lot of my items that i get really good deals on this is one of them i waited for this one and i i wanted this and i needed it uh, well, I don't need it, but I wanted it for my collection. This was something I wanted to try out, and I, I got it for a really good deal. You'll see here, this was 64 bucks. I'm pretty happy about it. But it was a guilty pleasure buy, and that happens. I mean, hell, sometimes it's okay just to, just to get a good deal. You don't always have to make shekels on top of it. Uh, but let's see what we got. We got some good bubble wrap, and you know I like to reuse my bubble wrap. I don't know if you can see it in here. All right, guys. Check this out. Dun, dun, dun. The Sega 3D glasses complete in box. Working Sega 3D glasses that are not broken. I have wanted these for quite some... Very nice wrapping. Good job on that seller right there. They'll get good feedback as long as everything checks out. Which it should. 64 bucks. A little bit high. It's still a good deal because you can still list this somewhere around 80 or so complete the way it is and get it. Uh, 64 I'm happy with this. I, I went ahead and made the plunge. Uh, I'm happy about this. It has the styrofoam. It has everything with it. And I'm happy about that. Guys, that's what it's all about right here. Getting things that you want. Look at that. It's even got the top layer right here. Check this out. Look at that. Look at that. Holy shit. They look good. I'm about to go try these out the second I get done with this video. Man, I'm excited. Uh, guys, that's it. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, make sure you leave a like. Let, leave, leave a comment down below. Let me some. Let me know some of the good deals that you get because you guys, when y'all tell me these good deals, I just I get happy for you. My shekler goes through the roof because I like hearing other people's shekels. It's awesome. Uh, but anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. And as always, take care and enjoy the rest of your day.